Okay, I know the audio is not synced, but I wanted to go ahead and start talking to let you know that I will be talking. You just have to give me about three moments, three minutes of silence, which might be a good thing for you. Hold tight. went out there I was cooking dinner oh well if we're getting specific I was nuking a half-eaten burrito I found wedged in my couch cushions yeah yeah I know I shouldn't have after all I heard microwaves zap out all the nutrients but hey it kills the cockroaches too so you know you win some you lose some anyway what was I right the power outage apparently some plant out in Santo short circ heard the EMPs were knocking AVs out of the sky the CPD says the blackout led to 120 mil in damages all in all. The real tragedy, though? I can't stomach a cold burrito. 120 million eddies? Hot damn. And just to get your hands on one dude. You got some cojones, B. Vote for Alex for mayor of Night City. Born and bred in Haiti. Champion of every night citizen. All right, here we go. So now that I can speak and hopefully the audio is in sync with my mouth, there is a little annoying trick that you have to do that takes a few minutes, but you know what? I'll live with it. I wanted to tell you guys about the very first time I played Cyberpunk 2077 as female V. The feeling of sitting well, down this is the place. and waiting Tick, tick, for tick, 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 a tick, guy tick. that I liked to drive up. Of course, this is not the case in this playthrough. I'm a guy, so I'm not getting anywhere with River. But I still wanted to wax nostalgic about my very first playthrough. And I also wanted to stream this mission because this is one of the best missions in the game. It's so interesting. It's so well done. Even when the whole world was hating on cyberpunk. People liked this mission. Hey, V. How you holding up? Been better. I know. Probably not hard to tell. So, what happened? Needed someone to talk to. Uh-huh. First. River's kind of needy, Take huh? Okay, so I want to talk. I'm torn. I want to chat because I'm chatty. 
but I also want to present this story. And I know a lot of people who watch my Twitch stream don't play cyberpunk, but they don't hate it either. So here's the, uh, I'll just let it play. Oh, shut up, shut up, shut up, Lainey. That's what I'm doing. So Peter Pan is the guy who went out of the driver's seat and went running and got zeroed by the What's police the officer. They caught the guy. My nephew, Randy. Disappeared not long past. And, and we will learn saw, that Peter Pan is one hell of a creep. Shoes. Oh Jesus. Ooh, ooh. And what? They figured you'd get emotional and kept you off the case? More like a restraining order. Won't let me anywhere near it. Gone that actually kind of makes sense. Lazy ass gonk. From a professional so far, standpoint. He ain't shit. But I still understand why River would be like beside himself. Yeah, I'm saying they're not completely wrong, but I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be a good buddy, and I'm gonna side with my no buddy because we're just buddies here. I know. And that's why I'm asking for your help. So what do we need to do? Can't interrogate the guy because he's a veg, but... We can view his dreams. I'm sorry, dreams? Ooh. You heard me. It was so freaking cool. On the way. Okay. It's an experimental procedure, but it's already yielding results. They record dreams that can be played back as BDs. You got access to these dreams? Not yet. How freaking cool would that be? To, now. to be able to record and watch your dreams. Because you know that you don't accurately remember your dreams. You, rem you get flashes of them. And in all honesty, having studied dreams to some extent, they really are just flashes. And any, any kind of storyline okay. that you Not remember exactly. we'll you together. pretty much uh, strung it together after you woke We're up gonna break the law to make it make we'll sense that's that's in. what the human brain does quick. you got it river actually been here so, uh... i know that for me i have about five or six different places that i tend to go in my dreams and they never look exactly the same, but they have this feel. Every place has this unique feel. Oh, so, okay. like, California has a feel. And the Renaissance Festival has a feel, a feeling. There's a general sense that this is where I am. And then a lot of my dreams take, take, a lot of my dreams take place in hotels. And that's pretty obvious. And then many, many of my dreams cross over with video games because, of course, that's what my brain is replaying because that <laughs> is a large part of my daily brain input. So, yo, River, I found a way in. Do I have to go let him in the front door? Uh, dude, there's another way in. Okay, you were saying... <laughs> I think I jumped the gun. I've actually been here, so I'll need your help. 
Yeah, okay, I, I found a way in. Just follow me, man. I got you. Not my first rodeo. Okay, shouldn't be anyone inside. An ashtray. Ashtray. That makes me think of ashtray from Euphoria. God, I want to talk about Euphoria. I want to talk about Euphoria so much. That last, that last episode where Lexi put on her play. Oh, that was epic. That was epic on so many levels. As a musical theater geek. Oh, my gosh. That was tailor-made for me. And then I have to... I have to ask myself and others in general. I need a hero, I the final no musical place. number in the play. Would we call that homophobic? I know that that's the word that Nate used, accusing Lexi of being homophobic. But if I'm going to be pedantic about it, that's not homophobic. That's very sex positive and <sighs> it portrays Can't get homosexual activity in a very positive, fun-loving light. I think the real issue is that everyone knew that the character was supposed to be Nate, and everyone kind of knows that he's not entirely straight, but he doesn't want them to know that. Do I need to take a leak? Can I take a leak? Nope. No urinal cakes for me. Anyway, I didn't find it disrespectful to the LGBT community by any means. I really enjoyed the number. I was kind of like Suze. I was, ah, yeah, it was, it was so much fun. And what happened to Fez? Where is Fez? Where is Fez? I was rooting so hard for Fez and Lexi to have some kind of, maybe not a romance. I think that he's technically over 18 and I think Lexi's only about 16. So that's, you know, that's illegal, but just some kind of sweet flirtation. Oh, I was, I, I was rooting for them. I, I hope Fez is okay. I've always loved him so much. He just keeps it real. And at first he seems, at first I thought he was just a dumbass. And then I was like, no, he's not. He's actually one of the more thoughtful and intelligent and together characters on the show. So I feel bad that I dismissed him as kind of just a drug dealer loser in the very, 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 very beginning. But I love him now. Love him. Locked. So I need to actually be scanning. I need to shut the fuck up about Euphoria and actually scan these rooms and play the game. There are no enemies to distract. Ah, 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 ah. Wait, is that, is that not it? I could swear that that was it. Maybe not. Okay, that's just a door. Ooh, that's important, okay. What do we have here? Can we actually use this? Yes, we can. We can. Anything important on this computer? Any important messages? Oh, do I want to go through all of these? I don't think we need to. I don't remember the computer playing a big role. I remember a file cabinet, though, but I guess that was a different file cabinet. It's been a minute since I played this mission. Yay! Need those. Okay, there's another room with file cabinets.
If you're watching this on YouTube or on VOD, I apologize for the awkward silence. I'm actually, I'm, I'm trying to focus because I've done something wrong. Okay, wait. No, this is the room I need to get into. And I, I forgot how to do it. See, usually I'm, I'm completely okay streaming all on my lonesome. It's fine. It's fun. I, I have a good time with it. Nope. Okay, that's the same damn room. But sometimes it would be helpful to have somebody be like, yo, dumbass, go in that room. Ah. <laughs> that would help. I swear it's this one. Oh, but no, for some reason, I feel like it's in this corner. So it is a different room. And that is locked. Frick. Ooh, this is a, okay, this is a room of interest. So comment below, tell me what you are thinking of the Cyberpunk 2077 1.5 update so far. I am on an old gen console. I do play on Xbox One unapologetically. And apparently there are certain perks and cool features that I'm not supposed to have access to because I'm a lowly Xbox One player. But I have found it to be really good oh wait here it is i think i think i seek no Ugh. Okay, my memory is flawed because I remember there being a cabinet right around here that had the key to everything. So I guess it is in the room where River is. So let's go back, go back, go back. I'm so dang fixated on this. It's interfering. It's it's interfering with my ability to do what I actually need to do. Again, this is where it would be very helpful to have somebody in chat being like, yo, you're looking in the wrong place. And it's so funny, that's so easy to do when you are the spectator, when you are in the audience, when you are the viewer. To be like, no, 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 it's this. But when you're actually playing, all of a sudden, your mind just goes blank. Does that happen to everyone or does that just happen to me? Because I know I will feel like such a smart, helpful person when I'm watching someone else's stream and they need a bit of information and I happen to know it. I'm like, oh yeah, I got you. And I, that just happens to be something that I remember about the game that they're playing. But when I'm the one playing and the pressure's on me, mm -mm. Okay, how have I not sir Oh, here's something. <gasps> That's it. That's it. 
I think. No? Fuck balls! Okay. And every time I walk down the hall, the doors open. Okay, let's take one more gander around this room. I know, River, you're getting mad, aren't you? <gasps> I would be too. Like, V, you're supposed to be helping. And I'm sure anybody who's watching this is like, it's so obvious where it is. Why can't you find it? And I'm outside now. This is where I came in originally. Okay, we've already looked at this three times now. Wait, wait. I thought that I had it. I could have sworn that that was finally it. Oh my gosh. See, I, sh I feel like I should be about halfway through this mission already and I've wasted so much time just wandering around. Oh, oh! Hmm. Is that all you have to say, V? Hmm. I wish I could at least open drawers. I'm getting frustrated. I'm about to rage quit. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hey, River. I think I got it. <sighs> Found something? Not yet. Anthony Harris. Let's try these drawers. Yes! Say, River, why not just have a janitor crack a door for you? Can't risk getting scolded for sniffing around somebody else's River. face. Yoan! What are you doing here? You got kicked off the force! Just suspended, actually. And who might you be? I'm calling the actual police. Oh, wait, 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 here. Whoa. Hear me out, please. I so know it's so never? annoying when I'm like... You weren't in enough trouble already? I need There's new glasses and contacts and I nephew. can't get in to see my eye doctor for another month. So you will I'm have sorry. to excuse the... Really, I am. ...face. But we store evidence here. And we have strict protocols. Protocols? Talking about his nephew's life here. A child's life. This is an ongoing police investigation. Go, please. Uh-uh. Get out now! We can't leave without Peter Pan's dreams. I'll say it one last time. Out! Damn it, Yawan. Who the fuck do you think you are? Remember your first med school exam? You know the one. Passed it with flying colors. Gotta remember it. Ladies' room erupted in flame. They evacuated everybody for two hours. I cannot believe you would throw that in my face. I never wish to see you here again. Oh, hey, River, can Especially you do that you. for me when I have to take my AAMFT well, boards? Because I am this nervous about that. 
River and I get along, we're friends. Hasn't let me down yet. Huh. I thought us friends too. Is that why you're refusing to help him out? Harris is dream beady. Where is it? He isn't dreaming. What? Why? I'm wondering if there's some contact. way that that conversation we'll can go horribly wrong. Pieces. I'm afraid like to allow it river. to go wrong. I'm, sorry. I'm afraid to experiment with it because this stimulation. mission is failable. And I think the only way you can fail the mission is to choose the, the wrong farm. Favorite song or and then River will the never talk to you again. Might be worth a try. Which I makes me question his character a little bit because, I mean, people make mistakes. And mm, you know? But Harris is not a child. I have never tried the Sorry, what she's saying adult. is interesting to me, so I'm going to listen. Let's try it. We don't even know his preferences. I'll find something. I mean you're willing to try. Just go. I'll open the front door for you. Let's ride, V. Oh, I think I, I exactly missed the start. interesting speech of hers because I was yapping. Cops seem to like you. Careful this one doesn't start sending you out for donuts. What? No, River's all right. <laughs> Johnny Fuck does have different mean. dialogue not every with male V versus female like V not every rocker boys when it comes to River. Don't know, v, you ever actually met a rocker he gives boy you shit if you're, a, if you're all, female V and you sleep no. with River. Johnny will be like, oh, God, V, I can't believe you made me fuck a cop. But then if you are male, V, and you sleep with Carrie, Johnny has nothing to say about that. He says nothing. Wouldn't that be five billion times stranger to be trapped in someone's head when they are fucking your very good friend slash bandmate? But yeah, he doesn't say anything. I guess it's because River represents things that he hates and it carries okay with him. I don't know. What do you think about that? Would it would it be stranger to be trapped in someone's head while they're boning somebody who just stands for something that you don't like versus someone that you are actually really close to in real life? I feel like that would be weirder. But that's just me. Okay. Off we go. Let me hear it. So, got booted off the force. Uh, I'm not judging. I mean, Mayor's death stank to high heaven. Inquest into, kicked under the rug. Seems like they were pretty corrupt, so honestly. Lost. Not worth asking how you feel about that. Nope. Yeah, River can be the still. strong, silent it's not type. not easy for me to talk about what's biting at my ass. Fair enough. Could tell me where we're headed, though. To Joss's. Randy's mom. She thinks he just ran away from home. For now, keep the kidnapping between us. All right, I want to know in. about Randy. What kind of kid he is? Petty theft, drugs, running away from home, that kind. Cop uncles really see the best in you. There are people who always find their way into trouble. Randy's one of them. Yep, I know the feeling. You gonna tell me why we aren't trying to find Harris's apartment? His house. I doubt he's keeping his victims in his basement. Besides, we are trying. Want to see if we can find some connection to Harris at Randy's. Pretty weak lead. Oh, Best but we I think we are going to find something. Think y'all want to actually help us? All things considered. Yeah. 
These tips of ours always end up the same way. I'll tell you about it over a beer sometime. Hell yeah! Sign Ooh, beer up. sounds good. I'm Randy. I'm bottom, so impressionable. Every time they mention Maybe something that sounds good, I'm like, "Ooh, that sounds good." But then I, I don't usually go eat or drink whatever they mention. Okay, I'm going to skip this ride and I'm going to do a little crackle check. Hold on. And we are crackling, so I'm going to stop here and resume. I don't know why. I don't know why it does that. I've tried, let's see. Okay, did that help? It should have been a while. He used to come over every weekend. A long time ago. It did not. I'll be back. 